so after the accident that i faced my life completely changed now i have a seed of fear planted deep within my heart and i can't do nothing about it because after what i faced after the trauma that i faced i am completely in that phase of fear and doubt of what might happen again i'm not scared of what will happen to me but now i am even more scared about what might happen with my family members with my loved ones with my parents or with my wife because i can't guarantee of anything in the future neither can i save them or make them avoid such situations and so i'm like captured in a dark room where there is only fear every time i get a flashback of what i went through i you know kind of get freezed up completely because then i get imaginations then i get uh, all those uh, situations which might happen with my family also completely uncertain of the future i have no guarantee of what will happen how can i give myself peace or bring myself out of this trauma when my family also goes out for work and so i'm scared and i'm fearful of the unknown future Jesus tells me something else. He says that when you are scared, you put your faith and trust in me. And that is what Psalm 56 verse 3 says. When I am afraid, I will put my trust in thee. That is what the Lord asks of us. I cannot see what is ahead of me, but he surely can. And if he has saved me from any further harm, after what happened to me he can save and be merciful to my family as well because if he loves me he loves my family even more and so whenever i am scared or whenever i get a flashback of what have what has happened with me of the trauma that i am in i close my eyes and i say jesus i trust in you jesus son of david have mercy on me Jesus I trust in your love and mercy. And so I want to encourage you today that if you are also in such a situation where you are scared and you have fear or you are in kind of a trauma close your eyes and say Jesus I trust in your love and mercy. Jesus son of David have mercy on me. Have mercy on us. Have mercy on my family. And leave everything to him. because he loves you and he cares for you and that is what he asks of us only one thing that to trust him and believe everything to him